from your weather authority, Chief Meteorologist Wayne Hart. Well, we're coming off what was more than likely our nicest weekend of the autumn season. It was a little warm on Saturday, 80 degrees, but lots of sunshine and the humidity was low and then mid to upper 60s yesterday. But that combination of comfortable air and sunshine, kind of hard to get, especially as we head into the latter part of autumn. Next weekend, certainly not looking that nice. It will be on the warm side, but we're going to have some rain at times. We'll talk more about that in a moment. But today was a colder than normal start at 41 but we soared to a high of 75 this afternoon that's eight above the average which is now down to 67. most of the area came in in the mid 70s tomorrow's going to be a few degrees warmer despite more cloud cover uh, and a little more wind uh, we're going to be in the upper 70s to around 80 degrees live first warning doppler radar is dry that should be the case until thursday night or friday morning that's when the first wave of significant showers will begin to work into the area but nothing other than blue skies across downtown Evansville for most of the day. Then late this afternoon, those mid to high level clouds came in just in time for a pretty sunset. And now we're still on the edge of the clouds here in the Evansville area, but they will be increasing as we head through the day tomorrow. 61 degrees, so not nearly as cold as it has been this time of the night over the past several nights with temperatures uh, in the 55 to 60 degree range. Fordsville, Tell City, a little chillier at 54. In general, we're going to wind up between about 50 and 55. Compared to last night at this time, we were running anywhere from, let's say, 9 to 16 degrees. or make that 17 degrees warmer. Uh, that is the case in Jasper. But in Evansville, we are 16 degrees warmer than we were last night here at around uh, 1030. So the mid to high level clouds coming up from the southwest right now. This rain will not be a factor for us, but these clouds will begin to thicken up across the area tomorrow. We're still going to enjoy warmer temperatures uh, than today, and Future Tracker shows that trend. Still some sun to start the day. By the noon hour, the thicker clouds are coming up from the southwest, and by mid-afternoon, a good deal of cloud cover across the area. They'll have some filtered sunshine. Highs will be upper 70s to around 80, forecasting 79 to 80 in the Evansville. Uh, metro and get used to that it's going to be pretty much the story for the rest of the week and even in the 70s over the weekend as those rain chances uh, increase now as we head through tomorrow night the clouds break a little bit it's going to be warm upper 50s for the low wednesday more of a mix of sun and clouds it'll be a little windier and that might knock the temperature down a bit but about 75 to 80 for the high on wednesday afternoon and then around 60 wednesday night for the low and we do it all over again on thursday with a mix of sun and clouds and high temperatures again will be topping out between 75 and 80. But we're still dry here Thursday evening at 7 p.m. Let me show you how long range this rainfall is going to play out. The first wave of rain coming in on Friday. These shades of green less than a half of an inch. So some rain scattering across the area Friday. It's going to come through in waves and this is the accumulating rain over the weekend. So by Saturday evening we're starting to get amounts topping a half inch over northwestern parts of the tri-state. So the bottom line for the weekend will be more rain northwest and somewhat drier conditions to the southeast. We'll be right on the edge of the system which will be stalled out here across Across central Illinois, then eventually that cold front comes through and brings an end to the pattern Sunday night into Monday morning of next week. Partly cloudy, mild overnight, 50 to 56. The clouds thicken tomorrow, but still breezy and very warm, upper 70s to around 80. And then we are in the upper 70s Wednesday and Thursday, 81 Friday, despite some scattered thunder showers. And here we are for the weekend, high still in the mid 70s, a lot of clouds and some waves of showers and thunder showers at times. The severe weather threat right now doesn't look too significant. And again, the farther northwest you are, the more the rain, the farther southeast, the drier it will be. And eventually the cold front comes through Sunday night, Monday morning, and that will bring an end to the rain and begin to cool us down for the early part of next week. Okay, thank you, Wayne. Still